Hey, hockey players, it's Coach John, director of the Chicago Horn Frogs, playing out of Chicago Park District's Morgan Park Sports Center. In this virtual session, we're going to continue to work on positioning. Uh, and in particular, we're going to look at the position of left defense. Uh, before we get into it, though, uh, I'd like to do a quick review of some of the things we talked about last week. Um, obviously, you've got three zones here, and uh, so we're going to focus on where you need to be in the defensive zone uh, for the first part of our virtual uh, sessions. Uh, once we're done and go through all the positions in the defensive zone, we're going to look at the offensive zone and where you need to be. Um, but real quickly here, from a defensive standpoint, uh, we talked about defensemen last week. Defensemen, as you've got an offensive player coming up the ice, um, you're going to be set up roughly here and here, and your job uh, as defenseman is to take away the center part of the ice. You want to take away the middle part of the ice and force that player to stay up the wall. Um, if you can do that and successfully take away the ice, then your uh, focus is going to shift, and what you're going to be looking to do is to cover the area of the ice that I'm going to highlight right here, which is roughly from here to here, and this is going to be your defensive responsibility uh, in your defensive zone. Uh, if the puck is on the wall there, your job is to either try and gain possession of the puck or tie the player up against the wall. Uh, you shouldn't be in there by yourself. If you are tying up the player against the wall, you should have one of your offensive players or another one of your teammates in there trying to help out. Um, the other defenseman would be over here covering the slot area. So if this were to happen and you're, you know, everybody's where they're supposed to be, uh, the puck, let's say it squirts free over here, um, the, your defenseman, this guy here, is going to swing over here and try and gain possession of the puck if we don't have possession already. That point there, you are going to come here and you're going to cover any offensive player there and try and make sure that they don't get a scoring chance. Um, while that's happening, uh, if the puck does uh, squirt free and come back in your zone, again, you're going to swing back over here. That defenseman is going to come over here. Uh, and what you're going to do is try and gain possession of the puck. You're going to continue to try and gain possession of the puck. Once you gain possession of the puck there, you'll have the puck. And again, your players are going to roughly be, depending on how your breakout is set up, um, they're going to roughly be here, here, and here. Um, so at that point there, you're going to shift focus again, and you're going to start skating up the ice along with your offensive players. And those players are going to be there and they're going to be waiting for a pass from you to create a uh, breakout. Uh, if you can break the puck out there successfully, uh, those players will continue to go up the ice as you will and they will go on in and they will try and get a scoring chance and shoot on the net. Um, so very important for you guys to understand where you need to be. Um, uh, as we talked about last week, understanding where you are on the ice obviously makes you a much more effective hockey player, um, and it's going to make the game a lot easier for you guys. It's going to make you understand it and see the game better. Um, next week, we're going to shift focus. Uh, we're going to still cover defensemen, but now we're going to go to the off. Uh, uh, we're going to we're going to cover defensive positioning. But next week, we are going to focus on. Uh, are the offensive players, so your wings, your centers. So next week, we're going to start with the right wing and where they need to be on the ice in their defensive zone and what their defensive responsibilities are. Um, in the meantime, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your week. Uh, if you have any questions, you can always reach out to us at uh, virtualfitness and mcfetridsportscenter.net. Uh, thanks again uh, for watching every week. Uh, we hope you guys are enjoying this, and we want everybody to stay healthy, and we hope to see you all on the ice soon.